At any point in history, there are going to be people who fit a demographic that is chastised, that is ridiculed, that is shunned, that even sometimes may have violence brought against them. Just because they like something, or they do something that doesn't hurt anybody. And it's sad that that's the case. And these people who are outcasts for those kinds of reasons are always going to be generally the most creative people in a culture, in a society. And it's my opinion that these people need to be welcomed with open arms. Because creativity and thinking outside the box is what drives the progression of society forward. I am very much a neophile. Now I understand that neophobes need to exist so we don't have stupid ideas being brought into the mainstream. But we really, really, really need the neophiles. We need creative people. Society can become very mundane. We need something to break the mediocrity. And I suppose there will be some people watching this video saying, well, why do we need to constantly change things? Because that's how it works. We're ever-changing. There is no let's be satisfied with things exactly as they are and never change. That's never going to be the case. Now granted, there are people who are incensed about, who are pissed off about the smallest of things. And we need to look at that for what it is. But when, for instance, people like furries get severely chastised, it, it just doesn't make any sense. Or they get even beat up. When transgender people have violence brought against them. It makes no sense. Sure, we fear what we don't understand. But hate? So we think the way that someone, I mean, even if we don't understand anything about someone, if what they're doing doesn't hurt anybody, why would it make us pissed off? Why in the world would someone commit an act of violence against someone just for being different? So, so unless you're pushing for mediocrity and everything to be mundane, and for everyone to think the same, and look the same, and act the same. It makes no sense for you to be angry at those who are just trying to think outside the box. I'll go back again to something. It's understandable when someone demands it from people and starts treating people like shit because they're not thinking outside the box. 
You don't make demands like that. That's not cool. And you don't chastise people and call them stupid and make them feel like shit about themselves because they're not thinking outside the box. That's not cool. I guess that's all I have to say for now.